So we're going to be doing the joint exam of the hip. We're going to start with our uh, active, then do passive, and then do strength testing. Um, so for starters, we're going to have Duncan lay on his side uh, with his head supported by a couple pillows as close to the edge of the bed as possible. So to start, we're going to have Duncan do some flexion with his hip. So I'm going to have him bring his right knee as far up to his chest as possible. Very good. And that is testing our iliopsoas, our sartorius, and our rectus femoris. And now I'm going to have ex extend his hip as far back as possible. And that's our gluteus maximus, semitendinosus, semimembranosus, and biceps femoris. He can return to neutral. And now I'm going to have him take his right foot and bring it all the way up to the ceiling as far as he can. And that is abduction, which is our gluteus medius, gluteus minimus, and tensor fascia lata. And now we're going to take that foot and bring it down to the floor in front of him, which is our adduction, which is adductor longus, adductor brevis, and adductor magnus. For internal rotation, we're going to have him return to neutral and hold his knees together and bring his right foot up to the ceiling, which is our gluteus medius, gluteus minimus, pectinus, and gracilis, pectinus and gracilis. Uh, for external rotation, bring that right knee to his left hip, and that is our piriformis, superior and inferior gemellus, our obturator internus and externus, and our quadratus femoris. Now I'm going to go ahead and do passive range of motion, so I'm going to have Duncan relax. And I'm going to bring his hip all the way to flexion, as far as I can go, and back to neutral. And then I'm going to extend his hip, trying my best to isolate his joint until I reach an anatomical barrier. For abduction and adduction down in front of him. Now I'm going to bring him through external rotation and internal rotation. So now we're gonna go ahead and do our strength testing. So I'm gonna have Duncan meet my resistance with my hand and push against me. Great, and he can meet and exceed my resistance. So he has um, five out of five strength testing for his hip flexors. And now we're gonna do extension. I'm gonna have him push against me. Very good, and he can meet and exceed my resistance. Now for abduction, I'm gonna have him bring his leg up to the ceiling against my resistance. Good, and then on the way back down, he's gonna squeeze against me for a deduction. Now for our internal and external rotation, I'm going to support the medial aspect of his thigh, then the lateral aspect of his lower leg, and I'm gonna have him meet against my resistance here. And that is going to be our internal rotation. Then I'm gonna swap, and we're gonna do the opposite and have him push against me. And that is gonna be our external rotation. So that is our uh, hip exam of the, joint exam of the hip.